Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. In this one, I'm gonna show you how to create logos for free. That's right, we're gonna create amazing logos, then we're gonna vectorize them. So we're gonna turn them into vectors that you could give to your clients. We're gonna, I'm gonna show you how to do that for free. And then I'm gonna show you how you can sell them on websites like Fiverr, for example, and make quite a bit of money. Now I'm gonna state up front here that I am not a hustle bro. I'm not going to tell you that you can work one hour a day and make $50,000 a month kind of nonsense. None of that stuff. I'm gonna show you the process, show you how much money you can probably expect to make. And you know what, whatever happens, happens. So let's go through this step by step. So the first step is you wanna to go to Microsoft Bing. That's right, something I never thought I'd say. Well, there, I just said it. You actually wanna to go to bing.com. When you do that, you're gonna click on this images here at the top. And when you click on images, you're gonna get a whole bunch of weird stuff here. Um, but uh, let's skip all that and let's click on the image creator on the right side. Okay, when you do that, you're going to see this here. You see this create button. We can now start creating things. And what I wanna create is a logo. So I've got some examples that I wanna use. So I'm just gonna go with a minimalist geocentric design. So here's just some prompts. I'll even put all these prompts in the description below so you can use them. Let's go back to Bing Image Creator. I'm gonna just copy and paste that in, and then I'm gonna click on Create. It's gonna go ahead and start creating me four examples. You can already see here that I've created a bunch of different examples already, but when this is done, I'm gonna come back, and then I'm gonna walk you through the next step of the process. All right, I didn't even have to leave. It's done. Okay, so we got a logo featuring a stylized bulldog using only simple shapes. All right, I like it. For me, I don't know, they're all a little weird here, but I like this bottom right one, so I'm gonna click on that. And there we go. Okay, so let's go with this. I'm gonna click on download, and it's gonna go ahead and put this in my downloads folder. So I'm gonna go to my finder, or if you're on a PC, it'll be in your Explorer. You can just load Explorer, and here it is. Here's the image, and you'll notice that it's a .jpeg, so it is not vectorized yet. The next step is you want to go to this website here, vectorizer.ai. The link will be in the description below. When you go to this website, notice that it is free to use at the moment. You don't even have to create an account or log in. Just grab the image that you created. So this is my logo, and I'm gonna drag and drop it right here. And when you do that, it goes through three processes, upload, process, and then fetch. I know, how interesting is that, right? So here is the original image that we just created on the left side. And here is the vectorized result. It is practically perfect. This is an unbelievable free tool. I'm gonna to go ahead now and click on the download button. And again, I haven't signed in. You'll see it says create account, login. This is all for free. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna make sure SVG is selected. Click on the download button and bang, it has now downloaded the image. You can see it here. So I'm gonna go into my finder. And there it is, this is my .svg. So this is a scalable vector graphic. Now if I wanted to, I could go into a program like uh, Adobe Illustrator or whatever you use for vector graphics and I can prove to you that it's vectorized by just grabbing the image and dragging and dropping it in here just like that. And when I click here under layers, you're gonna see all those different paths. So all of these things are layered and now you can make changes to it. So. You can use free tools, you can use Illustrator if you have it, and then you can make things like this. So if your client liked that, but they wanted to change the color, for example, you could go, okay, but we love the look, but we want it to be dark blue. Okay, bang, I just made a change to it in one second. That's how cool this is. So there we go, we've got our vector. Now, if we go to Fiverr, here's an example here. So this is just, uh, this is where you can make money, and this is just one of many ways, but here you go. I'm gonna to go to Fiverr, and then at the top here, I'm just gonna put in logo design. And then bang, I'm gonna take a look at what it pays. So I'm in Canada, and you'll see here that these are ads, so those are of no value to me. But here you go, $57 for a logo. I mean, if you look at the logo we just made, they're as good as pretty much any one of these logos, 50 bucks, 22 bucks, 300 bucks. <laughs> I mean, to be blunt, uh, you'll probably get on the lower end at the beginning if you did do this. And then as you build a reputation and you know you get more clients and you get more high reviews, you can increase your prices. But there you go, guys. That is the entire process in a nutshell. Create the logo for free, vectorize it for free, sell it, make money, work remote. Let me know how it works for you. Thanks for watching.